All right, guys. So I woke up earlier, and I thought I made a video of our mammoth, our Russian mammoth sunflowers are in bloom now. And there's another bud, and there's another bud. So you can put three plants in one pot. They may not get, you know, taller than I am, but they are so beautiful. I think they're the most beautiful flower in the world, actually. I mean, they even smell good, but don't don't just smell for too long or else you're going to sneeze your head off. But hmm. Hopefully the bees find them, so here's a sunflower. The thing, the thing I found odd about them is this is a single sunflower. This is a single this is a single bud right here that's going to open up soon. But there's another sunflower bud on the stem. So, I don't know if that's normal when it comes to these things. But this is in the dandelion, the daisy, the um, fleabane. What is that other thing? Sunchokes, Jerusalem artichokes. They're, this is in the same family, so. Yeah. I don't think they produce little Jerusalem artichokes, but it looks beautiful, though. Oh, wow. It, re it really lit up the garden. Let me show you. It really lights up the garden. It lights it up like a 4th of July night, you know? You can just stand back and still see it. Go back even more. Ten feet away. You can still see it. You can still see it. I'm walking all the way back, and you can still see that sunflower. It looks so beautiful. So beautiful. And it complements the, um, well, there will probably be more pumpkin flowers in here, I know. That the pumpkins are going to flower and stuff. But this complements them. It also complements our, um, pansies that we have. Man, this has turned into a garden answer video. And, yeah, even compliments the flea bang. I mean, not flea bang, the wound wart that is in, that is in the mint family. It's in our, uh, uh, what is this, our flower table, flower pit. So you can see the wound wart is flowering right now. And then we got some cilantro and lettuce and kale. It's doing pretty good. We did sow a couple sunflower seeds in there. So, as always, I hope you enjoyed this sunflowery video. If you did, give it an amazing sunflower thumbs up. Share it around. Make sure you subscribe to Reef What You Sow Gardening. It helps me heaps. Thanks for watching and keep on growing.